The Falk Wolf FW-190, famously known as the Butcher Bird, was an exceptional German fighter aircraft utilized in World War II. It was a single-seat, single-engine aircraft that earned high praise for its performance. Created by Kurt Tank, it was introduced in 1941 and swiftly established itself as one of the most formidable fighters of the war. Let's take a look at the features and characteristics that made the FW-190 such a formidable aircraft. The FW-190 was equipped with a BMW 801 radial engine. This engine delivered exceptional performance, particularly in situations where air combat was most prevalent, such as at lower altitudes. The initial versions of the FW-190 came with a BMW 801C1 engine, generating approximately 1,560 horsepower. Subsequent versions included enhanced engines to enhance overall performance. The armament of the FW-190 was truly impressive. The aircraft usually carried a powerful combination of machine guns and cannons, which made it highly effective in both dogfights and ground attack missions. The armament on different models differed, typically consisting of two 7.92mm MG-17 machine guns positioned in the engine cowling and two 20mm MG-151-20 cannons located in the wing roots. The FW-190 was an incredibly versatile aircraft that could excel in a wide range of missions. It was equally adept at dominating the skies, launching ground attacks, providing bomber escorts, and conducting reconnaissance missions. The sturdy structure and impressive engine of this aircraft enabled it to transport a substantial arsenal of bombs and rockets, ideal for ground attack operations. In spite of its slightly higher weight in comparison to other fighters of its time, such as the Spitfire and early models of the BF-109, the FW-190 displayed impressive agility. The design was carefully crafted to ensure stability, especially during high-speed maneuvers, while the landing gear was designed with a wide track to enhance this stability further. Combat pilots have lauded its impressive responsiveness and exceptional handling characteristics. The FW-190 was among the pioneering aircraft that prioritized the safety of the pilot by incorporating robust armor protection. The cockpit area was equipped with robust armor, ensuring enhanced protection against hostile attacks. This feature instilled a sense of assurance in pilots as they faced off against enemy aircraft or carried out ground attack missions in dangerous territories. The FW-190 was widely recognized for its impressive speed and exceptional climbing prowess. It was capable of reaching impressive speeds of 426 miles per hour and ascending to altitudes surpassing 37,000 feet. Its impressive performance characteristics made it a formidable competitor against Allied fighters, such as the Spitfire and the P-51 Mustang. Throughout its production, the FW-190 went through multiple upgrades and modifications, which led to the creation of various variants tailored for its specific roles. There were different types of variants, such as fighter-bomber versions, long-range reconnaissance aircraft, and specialized night fighter variants with radar. The FW-190 was renowned for its dependable performance and robust build. Despite enduring substantial battle damage, this aircraft has the remarkable ability to stay operational, enabling pilots to safely return to base even after being hit in combat. The FW-190 boasted cutting-edge aerodynamics that played a crucial role in its outstanding performance. The airframe design is optimized for minimal aerodynamic resistance and improved efficiency, featuring a sleek fuselage and elliptical wings. The wing design, in particular, significantly improved lift and stability, resulting in enhanced maneuverability and control of the aircraft. The FW-190 featured a robust landing gear system that ensured stability during all phases of flight, including takeoff, landing, and ground operations. This design greatly improved ground handling characteristics, particularly on rough or uneven airfields, and significantly minimized the risk of tipping over during taxiing and ground maneuvers. Despite its size and weight, the FW-190 had remarkable high-speed handling abilities. Pilots were impressed by the stability and control of the aircraft, enabling them to execute diving attacks and evasive maneuvers with ease during combat engagements. The sturdy build and carefully crafted controls made sure that the handling remained consistent even in challenging flight situations. The FW-190 featured a cutting-edge cooling system that effectively regulated engine temperatures by combining air and oil cooling. This system proved to be incredibly efficient in managing engine heat even during extended combat missions or in sweltering environments. The effective cooling system played a crucial role in ensuring the aircraft's dependability 
and enable it to maintain peak performance during intense combat scenarios. The cockpit of the FW-190 was meticulously crafted to offer the pilot an unparalleled view, ensuring optimal awareness of their surroundings during both flight and combat scenarios. The canopy provided a broad perspective, enabling pilots to detect enemy aircraft and potential dangers effortlessly. The enhanced visibility played a vital role in helping the pilots stay aware of their surroundings during fast-paced aerial battles, ultimately boosting their effectiveness in combat. Throughout the war, the FW-190 underwent constant modifications to integrate the latest advancements and enhancements. The adaptability of these variants led to the incorporation of advanced features, including upgraded engines, improved armament, and enhanced avionics. By incorporating cutting-edge technologies, the FW-190 maintained its competitive edge against the ever-evolving designs of Allied aircraft during the conflict. Not only was FW-190 a formidable fighter, but it also proved to be incredibly effective in ground attack missions. The aircraft could carry a range of weapons, such as bombs, rockets, and cannons, enabling it to engage and destroy enemy ground targets effectively. The aircraft's sturdy build and strong engine made it ideal for strafing runs and providing close air support, adding to its adaptability in combat situations. The cockpit of the FW-190 was meticulously crafted to prioritize a pilot's comfort and ensure optimal ergonomics. Controls were thoughtfully positioned for convenient access and operation, minimizing pilot burden during high-pressure combat scenarios. The layout of the instrumentation and controls was designed to be user-friendly, enabling pilots to concentrate on flying the aircraft and engaging enemy targets without any unnecessary distractions. The FW-190 was well known for its robust and durable construction, enabling it to endure significant damage during combat. The airframe was constructed using durable materials and fortified with specialized armor plating to safeguard critical components and the pilot. The durability of the aircraft was significantly enhanced, allowing it to withstand enemy fire and mechanical stress. As a result, the aircraft remained operational and practical, even in the event of damage. The FW-190 was genuinely exceptional when it came to diving attacks, thanks to its robust structure and sleek aerodynamic design. Pilots could confidently initiate high-speed dives, utilizing the aircraft's stability and control to target enemy aircraft or ground positions precisely. The FW-190's exceptional dive performance made it a formidable adversary in vertical engagements, enabling pilots to gain the upper hand over their opponents swiftly. The FW-190 had an exceptional service ceiling, surpassing the altitudes of many other fighters of its time. The impressive engine and streamlined design allowed it to ascend to great heights swiftly and remain fully functional even in the most extreme altitudes. This feature gave pilots a significant edge in aerial combat, enabling them to attack enemy planes from favorable positions and escape pursuit when needed. The FW-190 was meticulously crafted to ensure that maintenance procedures could be carried out with utmost ease, allowing for swift and effective servicing and repair operations in any given situation. Emphasis was placed on ensuring easy access to crucial components and systems, enabling ground crews to carry out routine maintenance tasks efficiently. The focus on easy maintenance significantly reduced downtime and guaranteed that the aircraft stayed operational for long periods. This played a crucial role in its overall reliability and availability for combat missions. In short, the Focke Wolf FW-190, nicknamed the Butcher Bird, serves as a remarkable example of German engineering excellence in World War II. The FW-190 was a force to be reckoned with in the skies thanks to its powerful BMW 801 radial engine, impressive armament, and versatile capabilities. The effectiveness of this aircraft in various roles, from air superiority to ground attack, can be attributed to its advanced aerodynamics, sturdy construction, and adaptability to new technologies. The FW-190 possessed remarkable speed, maneuverability, and climbing ability, allowing it to compete against Allied fighters effectively. Its sturdy build and clever design elements, such as enhanced armor protection and efficient cooling systems, greatly enhance its chances of survival during combat. The adaptability of this aircraft is evident in the various versions that were developed during the war, allowing it to remain competitive against the ever-changing designs of Allied aircraft.